Hi everyone, welcome back. For this particular video, we're going to talk about how to move your files into an actual folder. There's quite a few ways to do that, so hopefully depending on how comfortable you are with your mouse or your keyboard, you'll find a way that works for you. So first things first, let's open up our folders. So you can go to File Explorer in your taskbar at the bottom of your window, or if you know the name of the particular folder you're looking for, you could type it into the search bar that may be in your taskbar as well. Um, so let's go ahead and see how that looks. Now I have some pictures I want to reorganize and move into folders from a previous vacation. I know they're located in my pictures folder. So I can just type picture and under the section of best match, I see that it says pictures, file folder, and then my username. So that's exactly where I wanna go. Now, if you wanna access that through your file explorer and open that up, all you have to do is in your navigation pane on the left hand side click the pictures location that's on the left and it'll take you to the exact same screen so you'll see here i have some folders already set up and i have a particular folder for photo examples so we'll be playing around with that to show you how to move your files into folders so you'll see i have quite a few pictures here that i need to organize um, so some of them will be from a vacation in Tokyo and some will be from a vacation in Venice. So I'm going to show you the different ways to kind of pick out certain pictures to move just the ones you need into a particular folder. Now if you're more comfortable moving your pictures one at a time, that can be pretty easy if your picture pool is not very large. You can do what's called a click and drag. So you'll find the picture you want to move first, left click on it, hold down that left click and move your mouse across to where you see that little ghost of a picture. Move across the screen and you want to hover that item directly over where you want it to go until you see a little tooltip that says move to and then whatever the name of that folder is. Once you see that key indicator, you'll let go of the mouse and that item is now inside that folder. So that's way one, click and drag. That can be pretty hard to do repeatedly if you have quite a few pictures to go through or quite a few files to go through. But if you have the stamina and you're more comfortable with that, you can definitely do it that way. So way number two, you can do what's called selecting your pictures while using your keyboard shortcut. Um, this is helpful if you need to select pictures that are not all in a row. Um, because sometimes your pictures are kind of organized by either the date that they're uploaded or alphabetical order or they're uploaded by type. It can kind of depend. So if they're not all in a particular row, you could probably use this uh, particular way of moving your pictures around. So method number two. So you'll kind of see that I have a picture here for Tokyo and then I have a picture down here, here, and here. And so I want to move those four pictures into my Tokyo folder. So to do that, I'm going to click the first picture, saying this is the one I want to move first. And now while holding the control key down on my keyboard, it's on the bottom left of the keyboard, I'm going to select subsequent pictures by clicking on them one time to highlight the pictures I need. Now you'll notice I wanted to move just these four but then clicked on that one on accident. So here's how to undo that. Still holding that control key, just click on that picture one more time to unselect it. Easy as that. Now you can either drag all of these pictures over if you'd like to do it that way, but if you're not quite steady with your mouse, you can use your ribbon to help you out. So up at the top in the Organize section, I have a Move To feature highlighted. If I Click that one time and go down to choose location because I have a specific folder I want to move it into. It'll open up a window that lets me look through my different folders so that way I can choose the specific folder I need. So I'm in pictures, I'm inside this folder, and then I have my Tokyo 2015 folder I want to move those into. And I'm going to choose move. And all four are gone. 
Now here's what it would look like if you decided to click and drag that instead of choosing the move to option. So I'll put those pictures back in here so we can play with them. So I had this one, this one, I'm holding down that control key to select those pictures and I'm going to drag them over instead of uh, doing the move to. So I'm going to hold down that left click, drag with my mouse, and you'll see it's telling me how many pictures I'm pulling with me. I'm moving four pictures over to the folder. I have that move tool tip to let me know it's going to move them to this folder, and I let go. And that's it. Now, I only have a few more in here, so I'm just going to click I just have two or so that need to move in there. I'm going to select both of those. And this time I'm going to right click on them to see what my options are. Now you may see um, an option here where it says send to. That might not necessarily be where you want to actually send that uh, item to. So that might not be the best option for you if you're trying to simply move it to something um, within that same folder. But if any of these actually work, you do have that send to option as well. But you, underneath that, you have what's called cut. So I'm going to go ahead and cut. It's going to take those out, but it still left them kind of ghosted there. I'm going to open my Tokyo folder. And you'll see in my ribbon in my clipboard, I have my paste option highlighted. So you can either click that or use your keyboard shortcut control V to paste those items there as well. So that kind of is another option that might be a little scary for some people to do because cut makes it sound like cut, where's it going? But it's just waiting in your clipboard until you're ready to paste it somewhere else. Now let's go back to that folder. Now here's a simple way to choose a bunch of pictures that are all in a row together. So all of the rest of these pictures that are located here in this folder, oop, except that little stray one there, let's move him on into that folder. Um, the rest of these, and that one, <laughs> belong in my Venice folder. So to select all of these, instead of doing that control click one at a time, I can click the first one, hold down the shift key on my keyboard, and click the last picture. So what that'll do is it'll choose and select everything from that first click between that last click. So it'll pick every option listed here, so all of those pictures, and then this one as well. And then I can choose how I want to move it into that folder. I always find that clicking and dragging is pretty easy. And there you have it. So that's how to move your folders or your files together. Have a good day.